This is it. This is the one. The one that started it all for me. The ultimate rustler project. The vehicle that made popular for many years the very word jangification. Man, that's a lot of holes. When I first brought this truck in fairly stock form out to the track, local racers told me if I want to be competitive, I should throw this thing away and get a new vehicle. The funny thing is you could say I listened to them. Between 1999 and 2003, I replaced so many parts with things from Nitro Rustler, Fortec, SRT, not to mention a few handmade Delrin carbon fiber and aluminum parts. Factor in all the removed parts and there wasn't much of the original Rustler left over. Check this out. This was the hottest motor I ever raced with back then. It's a hand-picked, hand-tuned Trinity P2K2. This year marks the 10-year anniversary of the retirement of this truck. What better way was there to commemorate this than by putting it back out on the track one more again? Behold the massive 27 turn brushed power, 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 power. Behold the unstoppable traction of 10 year old dried out outdoor tires being driven on a wet, almost muddy clay indoor track. Behold the suspension setup that was optimized for, I, I don't even remember what it was last used for, J-Spec maybe? Think so. Now the truck has actually been kept in pretty good condition, I mean nothing has been re-lubed or anything, the motor hasn't been serviced, but it really hasn't lost much of its original performance, certainly the motor has not. This is just how slow stock class racing was. Can you believe this thing used to win races? If I wasn't there or didn't have the hardware to prove it, I wouldn't believe it myself. I enjoyed this truck immensely back in the day, but hey, I'll take nowadays modern stuff over this any day. What's most funny to me is that I used to be competitive with the associated RC10 T3 trucks, but when the T4 came out it was so much better that I just immediately retired this thing and got one of those. And the funny part is that the T4 is still being sold today and it's still the best truck in the world. That makes me feel a little bit better about putting this one on the blocks when I did. Regardless, there you have it, published on video for the very first time, my very first RC. Or was it?